All right, guys, welcome back to another episode of the Binding of Isaac Rebirth. Let's go ahead and jump into it again today. So it looks like we got a couple pieces left uh, on our file one before we get that Polaroid unlocked. We have to defeat Isaac so many times. I believe is that's how it works. So you have to defeat it lives so many times. Either way, let's do a new run. So last time, uh, the time before that, we did Isaac with the D6. We did Eden last time. Let's go ahead and do an Azazel run. We only got to the boss rush in Mom's Heart. We have a few more unlocks to do with this character. We'll try and keep things changed up a bit. Uh, play different characters as we uh, do more runs here. Uh, so this guy starts off with a mini brimstone. I think it's supposed to be nerfed, but I really don't think this is a nerf if I had to guess or if I had to uh, give my opinion on it because the brimstone is super powerful. Even if it's short range, there's never been a time well, I haven't played this character that much, but there's never been a time that I have played it where I was like, oh man, that is such a disadvantage having such a short brimstone that does so much power. Uh, we didn't get our item. Yeah, what was our item? I can't remember what our item was. That was right. It was that fly. All right, let's do the boss. Famine. Okay, so this is champion Famine. He will drop a soul heart when we kill him, and all he does is run, rush us. I don't think he drops any flies or anything. Uh, he does do that five-way tier which isn't very threatening now he does like monsters lung style bullets very easy so we'll go ahead and grab ball of bandages we'll take our heart um so we do have a key we only got three coins let's go check out their other room over here we haven't checked out yet now i forget is this character only soul hearts maybe that's what his deal is as well so similar to the blue baby except he's got brimstone which is really powerful all right, so yeah, I would go into the shop, but we only got three cents. It's really nothing we could buy unless the five cent item was on sale, which is highly unlikely. Let's go. We'll save our bomb for finding some blue rocks. Yeah, not only, he, not only does he start with brimstone, the little short brimstone, which is super powerful. He's also got flying right from the start, which is just crazy powerful. Flying is like one of those things that you don't always get. But he gets it all the time. Spider butt. Okay. Take that. Um, yeah, massive slowdown and damage, like it said. Two room recharge on it, so it's not terrible. I don't see any marked rocks in here. We only got one key. So I guess spider butt would really come in handy, like if we get in one of those uh, super wide rooms or whatever. Uh, oh no, he. So this character can get red health. I just noticed that since we do have a red heart now. I wasn't sure if that was a thing or not. All right, Joker card. So that's free double deal. Let's take it. Hmm, Book of Belial or this thing. Let's take this thing. I forget what that is. Contract from below. Does that give you the uh, double room drop? I think that'll be a good item. Let's go ahead and use that just for fun. So yeah, it does, definitely does damage to everybody in the room. And it's recharged now. The world card. Sure, we'll take that. We'll take the other one. What was this card? The fool? Yeah, we don't need the random teleport. Whoa, almost ran into that guy. Although those guys don't really do damage to you when you run into them, so it's not a big deal. Okay, <laughs> I took damage because I killed the guy and his fly hit me. So dingle, huh? Triple shot. Whistle triple shot. He's, he's moving. He's on the move. And now he's not going to do anything, so we can kill him. Awesome. So it takes Synthol. Damage plus range up. Now, the range up actually is supposed to affect him, although very minimally. So his beam does get a little bit bigger or a little longer, but nothing crazy. Uh, we got 20 coins. Let's go to the shop. Uh, our secret room's right there, but we only got one bomb. I'd rather save that to get soul hearts and stuff. Okay, so... I think... Let's see, what do we want to do here? I definitely want this. And that's giant flies and spiders, but we don't have anything that gives us flies or spiders right now. So I think it'd be kind of wasteful to take that. I'm going to keep our money. We'll donate it to the machine a little bit later on in the run. 
But for now, I think we're done on this floor. Let's go. We might be able to get to the boss rush. Uh, we're on pace. Really good pace, I believe, for that. Let's not do that. There's no point to do it. Yeah, we're getting a lot of keys and a lot of... Let's use this. They didn't do very much damage. We'll be getting a lot of keys, a lot of bombs, and a lot of money from these rooms with that double drop, which is really awesome. Miter, that's good. That's increased chance of soul hearts dropping. I like it. Or maybe it's an extra drop per room when you clear it. I can't remember how that works. It's something like that. All I know is that you get a higher chance of getting soul hearts. The sharp plug. If we had the D6, I would take it, but we don't, so let's just take the map. Yeah, really, this character feels too easy. I guess we'll take that since we don't have another trinket. Free bombs. Awesome. Gertie Jr. Double Gertie. Oh, man. Drops a soul heart. Okay, caffeine buzz. Caffeine pill. Uh, we got four bombs. I think it's worth... Oh, let's use the... Til oh, it's still a pill. Oh, our first I am error room. Look at that. So that gives us a free goat head. That's awesome. So we're going to get devil deals and stuff. Did I pick up... Yeah, it was caffeine pill. I was going to say, did I even pick up the boss drop? Okay, well, let's take the goat head and let's go. That's cool. First I am error room. So that's like a 10% chance or something happening uh, when you use a random teleport. So that's always something you got to be aware of. Okay. Hopefully those are decent pills. Paralysis. And since it's so good, we'll take it again. I love paralysis. All right, what's in here? The notched pickaxe that allows us to break rocks. I don't think that's better than what we currently have, so we're gonna leave it. Let's go into this room. Guppy's collar and the cat. Wow. All right, so we're two thirds away to Guppy. That's crazy. That's what we like to see though when we enter those kinds of rooms. That's the whole reason for going into them. Oh, troll bombs. Mr. Boom. Is there any rocks in here to blow up? Nope. We'll take our spider butt with us. Yeah, are we going to be able to do Guppy for three runs in a row? I don't know. That'd be pretty awesome, though. Just going to take our bomb. I'm not going to take that again. I kept hitting myself last time. Oh, we only had one key. Dang. Didn't even notice. Let's go ahead and bomb these three mushrooms. Hopefully we get another key so we can get into that room. Whatever that room may be. It's got to be good, right, though? I mean, it's a double key room. All right, champion. Does he shoot bullets in every direction when you kill him? No, he gives you flies. What else do we got? Let's go and try and find our keys real quick before we go do the boss. Can't get me over here. <laughs> All right, hopefully the shop is selling keys. Of course, I'm a derp. We can't get into the shop because we don't have keys to begin with. 
And I threw away the one key we did have on the double key room. That stinks. Yeah, I don't see any keys on the floor. Let's go do the boss. Carrying Queen. All right, so this might be one of the few times we're having the short brimstone might be a problem. But I don't think it's really a problem. Yep, no problem at all. All stats up. So does our brimstone go any further? Doesn't really look like it. I'm sure it does a little bit though. Uh, we're Babylon. I kind of feel like we'll take it. It might come in handy. All we gotta do is get down another half a red heart. Let's just go. Yeah, we had enough bombs where we could have found the secret, super secret room, but meh. There's our keys. At least we won't be able to, or at least we will be able to get into our item room. Whoa, guys. All right. Do we, oh no, there's still this little guy here. And there's this poo. All right, we'll take the counterfeit penny. Piercing shots is not going to really help us at all with our setup right now since Broomstone is piercing. Actually, it's spectral. It goes over rocks and stuff. Awesome. Yeah, I really think this character <laughs> needs a bit more of a nerf than just the shorter Brimstone. I don't know what it would be, but... It doesn't feel very difficult to play at all, that's for sure. Alright, let's look for some black hearts. Justice. Hangman. We don't need that. That's just flying. We'll do justice. Alright, what else do we got here? Uh, we got a lot of stuff going on that we haven't been to. There could be an arcade, there could be some other stuff. Let's go do that before we do the boss. We just take a quick sneak peek. I mean, we got plenty of damage and health and speed and stuff where it won't matter. Explosive diarrhea. That could be useful. Let's go and take that. We're the Teratoma pieces. That's spiders. All right, let's go in here. Greed. So much money. <laughs> That's awesome. All right, maybe we'll find a store. Nothing in that room. That's kind of a weird room store over here. Curse room. Two troll bombs. What is this play? Tears up. This one. Pretty fly. Awesome. Alright, so I think it was worth it to come over here real quick and just check it out. Uh, yeah, we're going down to the boss. Uh, we can blow these up. Black hearts. Let's blow those up. Black hearts. Yeah, I think there was a room up there that had a whole bunch of skulls in it. I was gonna go back and use the um, explosive diary in that, but I didn't. That's fine. The Senta, what do we get for our devil deal? We got a Krampus. Awesome. Coal is a straight damage up for the Brimstone, so that is very good. Normally, coal makes your uh, tiers get bigger as they travel. The further they travel, the bigger they get. But yeah, straight damage up for Brimstone, last I heard. So that is really awesome. Let's put a bomb right here. No super secret. We don't get any more bombs. Let's go.
Okay, we're kind of looking for a uh, a teleportation card. Like a fool or a stars card or anything like that to get us out of a room because we might be able to get to the boss rush. And I'd like to get the item, but I really don't want to do the boss rush since we've already done on this particular character. I mean, I guess we can do the boss rush if we're going to get an item for it, but... Oh, you know what? Let's do this. Okay, so there's our Horror of Babylon proc. So that's extra damage up. Let's use this. Take that. Awesome. Two keys. Get plenty of keys. Oh, come on. It's in here. Yep, we'll take that. That's the one that makes us go a little slower. We build rage over time. Actually, it probably would have been better if we didn't take it, but whatever. It's fine. They don't particularly want to slow down all the time. Let's blow those up. We might get some more black hearts. Uh, we've already found the item room. The only thing we didn't find was, like, the sacrifice room. Let's go do mom. That sounds bad. Let's go fight mom. Come on. Awesome. So take this. Let's go in here. Is there an item in here that we want? We got the stompy rocks. Lard is a couple of extra... Hearts and slow down. Hmm. We'll take the chemical peel. Let's just go ahead and do the boss rush. Whoa. Yeah, mostly the boss rush is pretty easy. There's a few guys where we're going to take some damage on. And it would have been better if we had Dark Bomb to uh, give us some soul hearts for the, all the red hearts we're going to get. I want to keep my red hearts down to a quarter of a heart. I don't want to pick any up. I'm sorry, a half a heart, not a quarter of a heart. So we get the Horror Babylon proc. I know we're going to end up picking up those red hearts accidentally throughout this fight. I'm going to try my best not to, though. We're still doing pretty good on soul hearts. Oh, how did we... Oh, we got placenta, which is regeneration. Dang it, so our horror Babylon is not going to proc. We really need to get rid of our red health is what we need to do to keep that active all the time. But I guess it was fine for the short amount of time we had it. I guess now it's okay for us to pick up those red hearts. Off the black art. Let's take that. Alright, Monstro. Oh, he hit us. Monstro's done. Widow. And Pin. <laughs> the Husk. Is done. These guys are done. Where's the other one? The bloat. Oh, that's right. Can't get directly blow him or to the side of him or he's going to brimstone us. He's done. Let's get the heart. And the mask. Awesome. Yeah, this fight is so crazy. Alright, war. Okay, war's done. We need to get death off his horse. Okay, let's just take a bit of damage. Alright, where's the horse? He's gonna be coming down this way. Nope, I guess he's cruising along there. Let's get him this time. 
the swordsman. Nice, we got one half of them done and the other half. Ah, <sighs> okay, very good, very good. Synthol? No, speedball. Speed shot speed up. All right, well, I don't think there's really much else we can do here. We can pop some of the poops and try and get some more money out of it. But all in all, I think we're done. We're at 18 minutes for the boss rush completion. That's not bad. We can still go back in there. Woohoo! <laughs> uh, what's in the double deal room? Anything else? Oh, did we not even look at the double deal? I guess not. I don't really want the blood trail. Going down. There was a pill on the floor in there. I just noticed as we were leaving. Now the boss, I kind of feel like is going to be down and up and around. Let's go downwards towards the boss. Okay. Awesome. And we're invincible. Yeah, I think we're going to be turning invincible pretty much at the beginning of every one of these rooms now. Because of that Taurus, I think, is what it was. Let's go ahead and run into these guys. And now we're going down. Oh. Very cool. So yeah, we should be looking for uh, marked rocks and stuff since we don't have any way to make soul hearts at this point. Um, so we, even though we're rushing through this, we still need to... Okay, there we go. That's a red heart. We still need to take into consideration our health. Uh, no, that's not a marked rock. Troll bombs. Let's go back for a second. We got plenty of time. And plenty of rooms to look in for, like, marked rocks and things like that. Oh. Nice. Um, also, bombs is kind of an issue, isn't it? We only have one bomb. Alright, what do we got here? Pretty fly. Nice. Triple orbitals. Cheers up. Pills. Lemon party. Okay, we now know what that is. I guess I'll take the telepills with us. Is that another telepills? It is. Alright, marked rocks. Not seeing any. Yeah, I kind of like to find an arcade or something that we can use our money on. Uh, maybe get some soul hearts out of it. I would like to get, or attempt to get, like, full health. Awesome. Open up, open up. Come on, I touched you. <laughs> okay. I guess we can just kind of fly around until that happens and we can just touch everybody. Take that, take our two keys from here, charge you up. Nice. Yep, runs like this where they're just super fast and like you're pretty much invincible. Not, you, we're not invincible, but we're pretty much invincible. These are always fun to do. Awesome. I guess we could also be using spider butt since we haven't been doing that. Touch him with the orbital. Oh, we got touched. Nice. Okay, hey, we're invincible. Just go ahead and run into everything we can find. Awesome. Was there something that dropped on the ground here? No, I thought I saw like a pill or something. I guess not. Maybe it was a bomb. 
All right, spider butt's back up. I would like to find Guppy's paw, really. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. no March rocks that I saw. Just double checking. No, no, no March rocks that I saw. Unless I'm blind, which I could be. It's happened before where I'm like, no, no Mark rocks, and I leave the room where I can't enter, and it's like, oh, I just saw one. See? Oh man, don't run into these guys, you nub. All right, well we got some bombs now. Um. Okay. There's a challenge room. Yeah, I haven't seen any marked rocks, which is weird because I know there has to be. I'm gonna blow this up right here in the center since there's like all of these guys. They could. No, there's nothing there. They could give us something, so I was gonna say. Let's do this. The soul heart out of it. Loki. Awesome. Pretty easy. Couple keys. All right. So it looks like we got one more room. Just gonna look at these rocks one more time. <laughs> I'm still not seeing any marks on them. Yeah, that's so weird. I've like looked at all the rocks and all the rooms, and I haven't seen one that is marked. That's very unusual. Uh, the telepill, we could go into our curse room and then teleport out. I think that's what we'll do. Oh, this is good. This could give us some soul hearts here. And it didn't. Just gave us a troll bomb. Let's teleport out. All right. Were there other pills on the floor? Yes, there are. Let's go try and find if any of those other pills are good. I can't remember. If they are or not, but we'll go and pick those up. Telepills, okay? So that's just as good as what we had. I'm gonna blow that up. There's a soul heart. I'm going to use this. I didn't use it like I wanted to. I saw that negative effect and I was like oh no what did I do wrong and I was like oh nothing that's just me using the pill yeah I thought I'd screwed something up there for a second let's blow these two things up try and get some more soul hearts if possible no all right let's do the boss the fallen all right we'll take it that's flies it lives. Oh, we didn't kill that eye. I thought we did. That right, should be a pretty easy fight here. Awesome. So I think we need to go up to the cathedral. I don't think we've defeated Satan or Isaac with this character. Let's go to the cathedral first. Because that's what we need to do. I believe we have to defeat Isaac six times in order to unlock the blue baby. So uh, the more amount of times we can do that, the quicker. I think it's going to be better for us. What is this? Chair abundance. Awesome. So we might be able to do some good stuff with that. Two soul hearts. <laughs> oh, curse of the maze. Two soul hearts. Wow. Hopefully we get a lot more rooms like that. So we have extra on the floor. So when we go... To Isaac, we'll be able to top our health up all the way. <laughs> 99 coins! Oh, I guess another thing. If we get two more soul hearts on the ground, we can use Jera on it, right? <laughs> oh, dang it. It's not something. Oh man, we got champion version. <laughs> All right, let's run into him.
Yeah, the champion version, instead of tr turning into two pieces, turns into three. Each of those purple ones turn into three each, so yeah, it can get a little crazy. Um, let's go this way. Okay, a couple of red hearts. Awesome. <laughs> I don't know what just hit me, but in case something hit me. Yeah, these guys... We can sit up on the rocks and not really worry about it. Okay, now that we've got the invincibility mode. Nope. Yeah, I guess I should really stop getting hit. Uh, because we do go into that crazy Taurus mode there. Almost every time after like two seconds entering a room. Red hearts. And look at that, we can do damage to uh, the haunt like immediately after entering the room. That's pretty cool. Oh man. Got him. Come on, Daddy. Come down here. Let me touch you. Gotcha. What you? I have no idea. Something touched me. I have no idea what it was. Um. Well, this is our last room. I kind of feel like we should go into the battle room and open the chest and use the Jerry card. Hopefully, there's some soul hearts to pop out of it. Well, there's a soul heart. I think we'll wait to the end of the fight because we might get another soul heart when we defeat all these guys. Okay, Monstro, let's go. Looks like two hits with the brimstone, he's done. Alright, so we only got the one soul heart. Let's use it. Two soul hearts. Um, oh, Curse of the Maze messed me up. <laughs> I think we could also look for Super Seeker Room, which I suppose could have some stuff in there that'll help us. Red hearts. If we only we had the Dark Bomb. All right, let's do it. Just touch Isaac a little bit here. Touch these guys. Okay, watch out for the beams of light. Guess we'll use that on Isaac. Ooh. Oh, he got me. Nice, we got him. We got him. <laughs> Achievement unlocked. Satanic Bible. Let's win. Satanic Bible has appeared in the basement. Aw, oh, yeah. 
All right, guys, that's it for this episode of The Binding of Isaac Rebirth. If you liked this episode, go ahead and throw a like on it. Uh, but yeah, that's it. We'll see you next time, guys. Thanks for watching.